Hello and welcome to another painting video. My name is Livia. I don't know about you, but I love painting flowers and botanical scenes. And painting roses is one of my favorite subjects. And if you've watched some of my videos before, you may have noticed that I love seeing the world from a painterly perspective and translating that vision into my painting. So let me show you some snippets of my latest painting tutorial, Painting Roses with a Painterly Approach. I've worked on this tutorial since last year, and I know that I have kept many people waiting. I sincerely appreciate your patience and support. I launched it last week, and wow, what a blast. I had so many people signing up and looking forward to going through the lessons. So let me show you some techniques and tricks I've included in this course. At the end of 2016, I created this painting on location and posted a time-lapse video on my YouTube channel. I never imagined that it would be so popular. I was walking around the garden when I spotted these roses in my backyard. I was so inspired to paint it that I didn't think twice. Got into my studio, grabbed my painting gear, and there I was, painting it just out of my garden. It was such a wonderful experience. This is my favorite rose bush, and I love the flower shapes and its colors. I painted it with all my energy and love. I've wanted to create a course about painting roses for a few years. I started working on that last year and I finally released it this year. And I'm so glad I still had this painting footage to include in this course. I'm so passionate about painting flowers in nature. And rose is my favorite flower to paint. And I love doing that from a painterly perspective. Combining color, value, composition and dynamic brushwork helps me to bridge the gap between what I see as an artist and what I feel. And that's what I focus on in this course. You will see how you can use fundamental techniques to express your passion for your subject and your presence as an artist with gorgeous texture and dynamic brushwork. I will show you how I work with the wet into wet method called Alla Prima to create a loose painterly approach in my painting. I will share all the tricks with you. This course is packed with actionable techniques and valuable content that you can apply to your painting. I will share with you how I created three rose paintings, two in the studio and one on location. I will take you step by step through my process while I develop these three painting projects. In the time we will have together, I'll hold nothing back. So let me share with you some useful painting techniques that I've gathered over the last 20 years of being a professional artist and an art tutor. Some of these techniques took me many years to discover. The first demonstration is a single rose. We are going to draw it by using the geometric shapes method to develop your perception and drawing skills. This demonstration is stage one in developing your skills. Then we go into a bit more challenge. In demonstration two, I develop a painting on plain air and add more spice to the painterly approach. You will see how I start with a general color, flat shapes and build up the roses layer by layer with a wet into wet method. Here I get more expressive, I let the birds guide me on the painting. This is my favorite demonstration. You will also see how I created a strong focal point there and how I pushed the secondary flowers back. And last but not least, it's demonstration three. You will learn a different color scheme as we dive into the orange colors. In this demo, I will start with a general color and build up a 3D appearance layer by layer, mostly with the wet in wet method, in that I explore reflected colors to bring a lyrical aspect to my painting. 
There are some PDF files you can download and print out to support your learning experience. So, are you ready to join me on this journey and learn how to paint from a painterly perspective? Check out more details below. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you again. Happy painting!